Ladies and germs, we're back, baby. Join me today as I continue my wonderful vacation, my vacation of literally working on my man cave. And I could not think of a better vacation than that. So let's celebrate by adding a few new cards to my man cave. <laughs> I don't know why I'm taking this off screen. Um, I am so excited because um, probably not the next video, but possibly the next video after this one. So the in in two in two videos, you might see a whole new setup. It's still probably going to be this desk that I'm at right now but I should have a lot more space uh, to move around and um, I should have a nice new setup so I'm not so cramped with, uh, with this area here. So uh, enough jibber jabber. Let's open up this hanger box. How are you doing? Let me know. I, I'm, I'm looking forward to the day when my channel actually gets, oh boy, oh wait till you see this. Look at this. Guys, come on. I, I saw a few of these out of the Series 1 box, uh, the complete set. But look at that. That is, wow, that is really rough. Um, that's a rough edge. So not great, guys. Come on. We have a, a little bit of a thick card in here too, so I'm excited because I'm trying to think. Uh, it could be a turkey red chrome, I suppose, but usually the thicker ones are the autographs, so we'll see if we get lucky here, or even a, a turkey chrome, uh, turkey red chrome. Pretty cool, so um, the, love the look of them. There we go, a nice Jordan gold cup. Rookie debut, not too shabby. Here's Jose Altuve, really had a, a down year this year. Really surprising, because he's usually so good. The past three years or so, he's really been unbelievable, and I can't think of anything that would... There we go, Devin Williams, Rookie of the Year. Nice card. I uh, can't think of anything that would have affected uh, Jose Altuve to really bring his stats down so drastically. Really drastically, it's weird. Something changed in the off season, I guess. <laughs> All right, enough. Uh, Pedro Martinez, Chris Sale, love that. And we get a Clayton Kershaw gold. Very nice. There we go. And it looks like we are going to get, uh, where was the thick card? Wasn't this one? Hmm. Huh. I mean, you guys saw that. I'll I'll play it back. There was definitely a thicker card there, unless it was just these two kind of sticking together. Uh, Ronald Acuna, very nice. Yeah, they they're not they're not extra thick. I guess maybe they just looked like that. And they really really looked like one, I guess. But it's kind of surprising. Um, all right, anyway, Turkey Reds, here we go. And then we'll get to the uh, exclusive blues, Stargill and Mike Piazza. Ooh, we're gonna get a number one prospect card of Brady Singer. I don't believe I have this one. So that's a great one. And then we're gonna get Craig Kimbrell as the blue and Miggy Cabrera, very nice. Very, very nice, I like those. Um, Keep these separately so we can recap the blues at the end. Uh, I think there's a pun waiting to be said there about the parallel, the blue parallels, and uh, whether or not you get big, big parallels there. You get the blues, one way or the other. Um, sorry, I'm a dad now, so I tell dad jokes. It's my bad. It just kind of comes with the territory, I think. Griffey Jr. I love that you can pull Ken Griffey Jr. cards out of 2020 update. There's just something nice about that. So, all right, so not too shabby. We get a gold card, gold Clayton Kershaw out of there. 
Not the worst box we've ever opened. And we got the Rookie of the Year, Devin Williams. Jordan, Rookie Debut. Brandon McKay, but that's just kind of whatever. It's whatever until next year, and maybe you can have a, a good year. Show us something. So again, look at this. Is that two cards, or is that a thick card? That looks like one single thick card, right? Huh. We'll see. We shall see. It's like I'm the worst magician of all time. I make the thick hit cards disappear. Here's the Alonzo that I had a uh, blue one in the last video. Drew Smiley, Mike Trout, Jose Peraza, Hudson. Peraza was a terrible, terrible signing for uh, for the Red Sox, only because they could have kept Brock Holt for, you know, what they got out of Peraza. And nothing against Peraza. I think he's a good player, but, uh, you know, just... I'll never understand that. Like, why, when you're getting production out of someone and he's a fan favorite, you know, why, why would you give that up? I guess because of the money. But, man, they made a lot of decisions based on the money last year. So, um, looks like we're going to get a Cal Ripken uh, card coming up. But here we go. We got a nice rainbow foil. We get a Cal Ripkins by the numbers, or a numbers game. And then a Ken Griffey throwback, very nice. Gavin Lux, Turkey Red, nice. Um, I'm gonna have a video on these cards, specifically the rookie ones. Um, and I'll share my thoughts then about those. Uh, Joe Adele, there we go, I didn't have this one. Very, very nice, didn't have it was hoping to get him of course this corner is dinged up this corner is always dinged up yipes tops really needs to figure it out all right so when it comes down to the blue parallels we get a clayton kershaw and a neil walker so again nothing too great the kershaw is great i'm sure someone's gonna want those and i'm sure um discount randy rose arena are we going to get Yes, we are. We're going to get Randy or Rosarina. There he is. Uh, in some legal troubles, but I think people need to calm down. I think he's going to be just okay. I think it's a misunderstanding that uh, none of us really know. Kyle Lewis? Oh, I didn't know. Oh, does Lazardo and Kyle Lewis usually follow each other like that? That's kind of cool if they do. I uh, haven't been paying enough attention to that to know whether or not that's the um, collation. But yeah, I think people need to calm down about uh, Randy or Rosarina. I think he's going to be just fine. I don't think his legal troubles are going to be anything really more than uh, what it already is. I think we're going to be fine there. Famous last words, I guess. But uh, Gavin Lux, Turkey Red. And then Devin Williams is the other marquee rookie card so we've got two of the three big true quote-unquote true rookie cards because randy rosarina and trent grisham technically aren't the true ones because they uh, uh already have rookie cards but they're the rookie cards on their new team so there's the joe adele very nice um i have this random pile of cards over here <laughs> over here i think i looked through so we'll just quickly go through these, uh, just in case I didn't. I think I did. Yeah, these are, uh, yeah, I looked through these. Yep, I did. Okay. Um, sometimes I get confused. I confuse myself. <laughs> All right, for blue, out of those two hangers, we get the Neil Walker, the Clayton Kershaw, Craig Kimbrell, and Miggy Cabrera. So not the worst names, because you get at least two uh, studs, possible Hall of Famers in there. And then Clayton Kershaw Gold, very nice to have. So uh, not upset about that at all. And uh, I'll, uh, I'll take definitely the Joe Adele uh, Prospects card. That's a really good one as well. So very excited to get that. 
Uh, thank you guys so much for joining me today. Make sure you uh, like this video, click subscribe so you don't miss any of my videos. And click that little bell so you get the notification so you don't miss my videos. Um, and uh, comment down below what your favorite card is out of uh, what I picked today uh, or just out of update. Let me know what you're collecting and, uh, and what you're looking for. So, And let me know if you're chasing down these parallels. Um, got some good feedback in the last video about the blue parallels and just parallels in general. So uh, always good to have discussions. Um, make sure you comment below because I will respond to it and, uh, and we can have a little chit chat. So anyway, um, thank you guys so much for watching today. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter at GDubs Collects uh, and make sure you comment down below um, and, uh, and we can uh, have a little discussion. I love talking to you guys and I love hearing the feedback. So keep it coming. Uh, Thank you guys so much for watching today. Stay safe. Keep the hobby alive. Keep on collecting.